What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I got a short, easy DIY how-to video for you guys today. It's gonna be super simple for you and all it's about is actually about LED headlights and high beams for the Z32. So with that being said, I just wanna give you guys a little bit of background of it. I've just noticed recently that my car has just extremely dim headlights. For some reason with the Z32, I just cannot understand, like it's just, they're so dim. It's probably just old technology. I did some research on the forums. I did some research just in the Z32 car community. And I found that that these Oxido LED lights are probably the best bang for your buck. And it's a very, very simple way how to install them. So what I'm gonna do, it's obviously sunny out. What I'm gonna do is wait a little bit till it gets dark. And I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to install these. So as you can see, they're not very bright. <laughs> they're not very bright. Um, mine might be a little bit lower because the car is a little bit lower, but they're not very bright at all, okay? So this is what I see every day that I'm driving the daily, every night, not very bright. So it's very simple. On this side is your low beam. On this side is your high beam. On this side is your low beam. On this side is your high beam. Very simple to fix. Uh, the light bulb size is a 9006 for your low beam and the high beam is a 9005. The kit actually comes with both. So it's super sick, okay? And it's super cool to know that it's just plug and play. So all you have to do is undo your light bulb and put this one in, you're good to go. So the main reason why I'm kind of filming at night is to show you guys the difference. So working on the passenger side light here, all I'm gonna do is turn this take it on out as we can see we're just gonna unplug this and plug in the new one as you open the box you can actually see here we go comes the whole kit and let's see if these are labeled the ones with the red uh, o-ring are actually the high beams and the ones with the black o-ring are the low beams nice and dark for you let's see the difference it's so much brighter I still have to adjust them a little bit, probably bring them up a little bit and probably space them out a little bit, but that is ridiculously more brighter than what it usually is. And it actually has that kind of like very bright white look, way better. Nice, let's do the high beams. All right guys, so low beam and high beam, whoa. Low beam, high beam. Pretty crazy. I love this white look though. Instead of that old halogen yellow, it looks so sick. So that's basically it. It's a very simple, easy how-to DIY. There's no cutting, no splicing. It's literally a direct fit right into that uh, housing and it's good to go. And you can clearly see the difference. It's ridiculous. So again, these Oxido LED lights are no joke. I'll put the link in the description. You guys need to go grab them ASAP because they freaking work. But again, if you guys enjoyed the content, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. If you have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And going on from there, if you're looking for any additional how-to or DIY videos, click this link. If you're looking for any drifting videos, click down below. In the meantime, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.